guys, it's me once again, Bad Luck Bentley. I'm back, it's week 10, and this is my final ever vlog. That's unless I've discovered a new talent and become some mad vloggist, but I highly doubt it. Okay, so this week is by Lev Manovich. It's called What Comes After the Remix, and it's all about current contemporary remix culture and the big strong question of what actually happens next. Okay, I enjoyed this reading. Um, the question of what happens after the remix, however, that's a really broad one. The um, reading sort of refers to the current remix culture as like our Iron Age, the industrial revolution of contemporary times. I, I can see what it means. It's pretty bold to say something like that, considering, you know, maybe medical innovation is the sort of big thing of our times. Maybe it's something else. I don't know. However, with regards to remix, yes, there are a lot of remix things in our life. This reading really made me consider how the likes of Glitch Art, Wikipedia and such are remixes and also gave me a bit of food for thought for our uh, music video mashups which we did a few weeks back. Well done Lev Manovich, you made me think not many people can do that. So yeah, the um, the reading goes on to talk about how um, music seems to be the only cultural uh, culturally acceptable form of art to remix. This is both in terms of copyright and sort of ownership, intellectual property, that kind of thing. I like this argument so much, I've based my final project on it and you can see that on my Tumblr page, which I'm sure you're following or must be on if you're watching this video because this is where it is. And that, my pretties, is... that's about it. That's all I've got for this week. It's short and sweet, nice and concise. And these videos are only meant to get shorter anyway as it goes on. So, thank you for watching. Carry on to do Tumblr things with me and enjoy my final project.